Well, this is Blue Star Warrior 1 here. All the glory goes to the Lord Jesus Christ, our Savior. And today I'm going to be reading the first book of Adam and Eve, the Forgotten Books of Eden. And it's chapter 17. And Lord Jesus Christ is coming soon, and all the glory goes to the Lord Jesus Christ, our Savior. The title of this chapter is The Chapter of the Serpent. Hmm. Then Adam and Eve came out of the mouth of the cave and went towards the garden. But as they went near it, before the western gate, from which Satan came when he deceived Adam and Eve, they found the serpent that became Satan coming at the gate, and sorrowfully licking the dust, and wiggling on its breast on the ground, by reason of the curse that fell on it from God. And whereas before the serpent was the most exalted of all beasts. Now it was changed and became slippery and the meanest of them all. And it crept on its breast and wet on its belly. And whereas it was the fairest of all beasts, it had been changed and was become the ugliest of them all. Instead of feeding on the best food, now it turned to eat the dust. Instead of living as before in the best places, now it lived in the dust. And whereas it had been the most beautiful of all beasts, of all which stood dumb at its beauty, it was now abhorred of them. And again, whereas it lived in one beautiful home, to which all other animals came from elsewhere, and where it drank, they drank also of the same. Now, after it had become venomous by reason of God's curse, all beasts fled from its home, and would not drink of the water it drank, but fled from it. And Lord Jesus Christ, holy name, amen. And what, what was the serpent before it became what God traded it to? It was a dragon. It had wings. It was beautiful. It was gorgeous. I mean, just think about what dragons look like. I mean, they're, <laughs> they can look very fearsome, frightening, and very, uh, very, I mean, going by what dragon you're looking at in paintings by humans, you know, they can be very pretty. <laughs> and uh, that's what, what the serpent was. The serpent was a dragon. It had wings, and it was beautiful looking. But God changed it. <laughs> Because it was, you know, it tempted Adam and Eve. Because Lucifer had became that dragon and used and was at the fruit of the tree of knowledge of good and evil and tempted Eve and, and Adam into partaking in its fruit. And so God changed it from looking like that into a serpent slithering around on its belly. And it's now venomous because of its curse. And so nobody, no creature wants to be near it because it's dangerous. Because it can kill them. And it can't fly anymore. It has to slither everywhere it goes. Well, isn't that interesting? We got to meet the serpent once again. And I'll be back as the Lord leads. And I hope you enjoyed read hearing this reading. Please accept Lord Jesus Christ as your Savior. He died on the cross for your sins and he shed his precious blood for you. He loves you and he's knocking at the door of your heart. And on the third day, he rose and been with God and sat at the right hand of the power of God. Well, I'll be back as the Lord leads.